Hi, I'm Luana Whitner Basin, and I am the events coordinator of MSC. And today I am talking with a vaccine skeptic. Hi, I'm Faisal Alamgir, faculty in the School of Material Science and Engineering. Um, I'm a vaccine skeptic. Let's get right to the point, Luana. I don't want to take the COVID vaccine. I and change my mind. Faisal, if you really don't want to do something, I probably can't change your mind, but you're a grown man. That's debatable. <laughs> and hopefully I can try to address your concerns and maybe you will change your own mind. All right, and try this out. How can I trust the vaccines when they were developed so quickly? COVID is not completely a new virus. Scientists have been working on the COVID virus for years. If you look at the can of a Lysol, it stated that it fights COVID. That is because if the virus is not new, just this strand. Viruses, vaccines were developed quickly because a lot of people and resources were poured into the project. Uh, what if I don't want to be a government guinea pig? Faisal, there, are, there have been millions of people throughout the world who have volunteered for the trial of the vaccine. That is the whole purpose of the trial phase. You might say that there were millions of millions who volunteered to be guinea pigs so that you don't have to be. Okay, so they were the guinea pigs. Oh, that, yeah. that's... That's good, um, but then I'll just wait and see how the others are affected by the vaccine before I get it. Again, that was the whole purpose of the human trial, but I hear you. Look around though, millions of people have already been vaccinated and we are vaccinated in the United States at more than 2 million people a day. There have been no reports of serious side effects so far, from the Pfizer, Moderma, and the J&J &J vaccines. And by the way, Faisal, you like coffee, right? Did you say coffee? <laughs> yes, coffee. You know I like coffee. So wouldn't you like to sit at a cafe and drink your fancy coffee without worry about catching the virus? Uh, you know what I'd really like? I'd like to have my own cafe Okay, Faisal. All right, let's get back to uh, my skepticism. <laughs> Maybe I already had the COVID and so I don't need to get a vaccine. Everyone should get vaccinated if you've, even if you've had COVID. Scientists do not know how long you are protected after having the illness and people who have contracted the illness have gotten sick again. Some people say, not me, mm -hmm. that the vaccine will change your DNA, you know, like turn you into the Hulk and prevent childbirth. What do you say to them? Really, Faisal? The vaccine will not change your DNA. It does not penetrate the nucleus of the cell. It's not me, some people were saying. Some people. Asking for a friend. <laughs> All right, I need a customer guarantee. Will the COVID vaccine stop me from getting COVID? Getting the vaccine, Pfizer, will not stop you from getting COVID. See, I knew it. It will not stop me from getting COVID. But what it will, it. Pre but what it will prevent you is from dying from COVID. That is why it's important for you, for you to continue to wear your mask, practice social distancing, so that you don't get, get it and spread it. So, oh, Miss Smarty Pants, which vaccine should I get? Smarty Pants. Scientists suggest that you should get any vaccine that is offered to you. The Pfizer and Moderma vaccines may have higher effectiveness, but it is believed that the effectiveness of J&J &J vaccines increases over time. Is it required that I get the vaccine? No, it's not required. Are you going to force me? 
no, I'm not going to force you, but you're going to delay us going to the cafe. But, well, as long as it's up to me, I don't want to give up my freedoms. <laughs> it's up to you. So, are you going to get vaccinated? I could, but what's the use? There are already new variants out there. The vaccine won't work on them. The vaccines may not be as effective on some of the new strains. Research is being done on that, but this is always the case of viruses. There are new flu shots each year since the viruses change. We have to keep up. Alana, I have one last question. Yes. Will you be my life coach? I'm already your life coach my friend, <laughs> and it's, I'm doing it for free. <laughs>